one of the things with Final Cut Pro 10.0.6 is that these three buttons right here, the crop button, the uh, transform, and the shift button, that's all been consolidated into one button. And also, this button and then this loop playback is no longer there. So I'm going to just show you how to access all of these three buttons and then loop playback. And then we have the I, which is now replaced with the share or with this button right here. So uh, let's minimize that. And the first thing is a lot of people have questions about Ken Burns. So, well, where's the Ken Burns? So, hey, I click on, I click on it. I'm looking for it. I'm looking for it. But if you click on it, and it's, Ken Burns is right here. It used to be up here, up top, but now it's right here. Okay? The I button, where the information, same thing, it's right there. Command 4 is the shortcut to get the I button or to this button right here, the information. Uh, I just always call this information button. All right, and then we have the share. And that's a very powerful thing that you can do. You can share all of these uh, uh, destinations. And then what I've done, I created a batch. And I'll do another tutorial of how to create a batch uh, list with Final Cut Pro 10. Then last but not least, you have the transform, and then you have the crop, and then you have the distort. And all the things here, same keyframes all up here so it defaults to what you have used last so whatever you have used last that's what it's going to stay on so it's not hidden or not anything like that so you can just click there and click it to uh, get off all right so the loop playback that used to be here this is of course the view full screen and then the loop playback is going to be up here on the view playback and then loop playback play full screen play to end and then here, here are all of the shortcuts so it's just another good idea to know these shortcuts because you're looking for buttons, you're looking for buttons, but the shortcuts uh, don't change. So that's why I would try to advise you to learn the shortcuts and then you don't have to worry about too many buttons. And this is, of course, to go and to jump and, and, and to play and things like of that, of that nature. So that's all for this tutorial. We'll see you soon.